Welcome back guys to another Slime is a Kind Memories video and today we'll be talking about how to optimize your phone's performance. Now essentially, you may have had many errors in this game, for example, your phone hitting up too much, the performance every time a certain quest is done, it crashes, the, for example, the battery drains too fast, or you get a lot of crashes when you're in, in the town or in game. As always, so for example, right here, right now, I'm playing with an iPhone 8 to give you an example. Uh, this is not the best of the phones to play this game as the performance for this game is usually very high. And it does need a lot of RAM and other stuff, more technical stuff, in, in more technical specs. As my phone is kind of like potato-ish to run this game. So, how did I do it? How do, do I avoid crashes and how, do I, how am I able to play this game for so long? Well, essentially there are various ways to do it. Essentially what you have to do is go to, to options. There's also notifications tabs if you want to you know when all your stuff is done. But settings, the main one is graphic settings. There's high for the players that have very good specs, very good phones. For example, the latest versions of each Android or Apple phones. Medium is for the phones that are like, let's say pretty decent. Let's say iPhone 10s, you know, high-end specs phones and then there's the low ones for the people that have kind of potato phones or phones like that are older versions of the android or ios versions then i suggest you should press low low will allow you to play the game at a much lower lower performance and essentially you will you will avoid crashes of stages you will avoid your phone being a microwave and essentially heating up so much and you will also avoid your battery draining at a pace of using Bolt. So essentially your phone will be able to last a lot longer as well. There's also going to be battle settings where you'll be able to put the skip battle skill animations but essentially this is not fixed at all yet. You are you are able to skip the, the actual skills animation where the character powers up but essentially the battle animations where they do the special skills aren't they're not able to be skippable at the moment if you're wondering how to increase your performance on the on the pc version of the game well, i'll show you it right now basically if you're playing on the emulators of like nox or blue stacks what you've got to do is you change the graphic settings back to opengl when you're doing all your gameplay and but only if you want to recruit for characters and all that you should change it to direct x only for summons that's essentially the game will be able to run smoother and you won't have crap you won't be crashing all the time